Hi there, Simon from simonwoods.com with a little bit of a bubble in my throat. I'll try and uh, cough it out. Well, I'll, I'll tell you about the wine first and then I'll cough it out. Uh, this is uh, Fabre Montmaillou, uh, from, from, that's the winery, and it's the H.J. Fabre Malbec 2014 Barrel Selection. Not from Mendoza, but from uh, uh, Rio Negro down in Patagonia. So let's give this a whirl, see where we get to. Warm, fresh black currant, blackberry, a little bit of earthy violet in there. Uh, it smells like it's going to have a quite a bit of weight to it, but uh, Patagonia's further south is a bit cooler. Uh, so what you'll find with a lot of the wines there is they've got reasonably high alcohol, but um, there's always this freshness about it. Let's see what the alcohol is on here. I can't see it on first. It, it must be on there. Fourteen and a half percent. So uh, they usually carry their their, their alcohol quite well uh, in this part of the world. The wines, not the people. And there's almost a menthol character to uh, to the fruit here. Uh, yes, a little bit of, um, sometimes I get violet uh, character coming through in, um, in in Malbec. There's maybe a little bit of that, but this is this menthol, herby menthol character as well. Lots of juicy fruit uh, and this um, uh, backbone of tannins which have just got that nice edge of greenness. So it's not that, that it's not all wobbly, blobby wine. There is this um, uh, this uh, slight sternness, but because the fruit wrapped wrap around that backbone, wrap, wrap, wrap around that um, upright backbone, is so voluptuous. It works well. Uh, the, it's got this freshness coming through and. Um, I never know with wines like this how long to keep them. I, I, I like them at this stage. Uh, I've, I've tried aging some Malbecs and once they've lost that slight edge of young perfume, uh, some of them you think, right, okay, it's past its best. Some of them, some of them do survive and probably the Patagonian ones survive as, as well as the, some of the uh, uh, warmer, lower acid men uh, ones from Mendoza. Here, um, I'd be in there the next two or three years and it'll probably live beyond there but I don't know if it's going to get better but uh, to be honest I'll be setting into it tonight hey see you soon